pick that's in that deep dura pan that's coming up the multi-purpose pan we'll see in a few it's the same exact thing now in a baking sheet i mean unbelievable and Our actually chef... of those three thousand that we sold that one night yeah nearly five star reviews across the board i think i think the average of it is 4.6 it doesn't surprise yeah. me they're, I mean, they're they're brilliant. they work so so well and remember they're durable too so if you've got a bunch of scratched up dented warped baking pans Stay tuned for those. They're coming up. We'll order them right now. All right, chefs, now we're going to move on to one of your most popular items. And a lot of things that you do, always so well thought of and brilliant, but everybody raves about your trivet. They love this <laughs> trivet. You know, I can't believe this trivet has become, it's got like celebrity status. It's like a it's cult crazy. following on this it trivet. It does, people. And look, I don't blame them because it works so, so well. You can see I'm frying chicken, okay? So you, I, I want you to, I want you, I want to show this to you because what this trivet is, it's a roll-up trivet, right? Right, which means it's somewhere to put something hot. That's it, it's that simple. It's pieces of really hard steel, and then on the outside of that we've put silicon. So, you think that silicon would melt, right? Well, right. watch this. I'm still frying the chicken, and I've put the entire pan onto it. You can take it to 500 degrees, wow. and truthfully, even more than that, but that's what we say, you gotta cap it somewhere. Right. But it's not just a trivet. It's not just something to put hot things on. Wait till you see how this works. So I've now, you were mentioning these little, uh, this little bakeware. I'm gonna give you a sneak Ooh. peek, you guys. Here it is. Here's your first so look. I've got, this is the first look. I've got a piece of the bakeware there. I'm gonna stick a trivet over the top. And guess what? It's no longer a trivet. It's now a rack because it's somewhere for my fried Brilliant. foods to drip all their oil through mm. to give you a healthier, crisper result. So you can use it in so many different ways. And I'm just gonna get cooking and show it to you because it's it's really fun to demonstrate because there's just so many different things there's you so can much do. All right, here we go. Um, 220 of the customer reviews on here are perfect five stars, right. which is huge. We're going to show you a couple of them. Here are some of my favorites. I love this one. Wasn't sure. Now I wish I had two. Right. I thought that was it. Because really, you look <laughs> at it and go, what is that? And by the way, you can try your dishes on this. Another one says, does uh, wonders. This one says, takes up no storage space. And Chef, I really love that too. Because if you just use it to dry your dishes, or maybe you have fancy glasses that you don't want to put in the dishwasher, yep. let's say, you know, beautiful wine glasses, you can use it over your sink, right. and it's a perfect drying rack. Also, another gal commented I thought was brilliant. You know when you're washing your vegetables? and it tends to all that water especially if you're doing like a pepper yeah. and that water tends to get into whatever you're cooking and then it kind of ruins the recipe drying and setting your vegetables when you're washing them on here over the sink another brilliant idea right oh, look at this with your pans so look at this I'm, I'm frosting a cake here actually I'm pouring a ganache over the top wow. and I'm purposely pouring more over knowing that it's going to run straight through the rack so it becomes a really great generous sized rack you don't normally have a rack that size no. that can do that much I love it the fact too is you make you can customize it. Right. We have people who wrote reviews who use it in their RV, and yep. RV sinks are little. Right. And she loved it because it actually worked in her little sink while it can hold a big sink as well. Now, I'm cooking in a cast iron pan. I know what you're saying. He doesn't cook in cast iron. He cooks in Dura pan. I'm doing it on purpose. Have you got some of these at home? Everybody does, right? So let's stick one of those down and take a nice hot pan and drop that on there. And let's just give it a second because I guarantee you, <laughs> you're gonna burn it, right? You're gonna burn your countertop if you're not careful. You're gonna right. chip the marble on the counter. You're gonna burn the, it doesn't matter what you have, wood, stone, you can ruin a multi-thousand dollars. You can spend two, three, four thousand dollars on your island or your countertop and you can damage it in seconds. Now oh look at what God. I've done to that trivet. Yeah, okay. totally ruined. So yeah. see the difference? That's how it started out and now it's ruined, right. Right? right? But watch what happens when I take the exact same pan. In fact, I'll put it on the heat to get it even hotter. This is how silly we've been. We've got a little thermometer here to see just how hot we can get things. Awesome. You know, we have a coal burning oven at the restaurant in Los Angeles. Mm -hmm. Stuff's coming out of that coal burning oven all night long, straight onto my trivet. No problem. You're not going to damage your countertop. You're not going to damage your beautiful stone um, benches. You're going to be left with... Can, can let I me ask pick you a question? Because you, you saw it burn the cork Oh, one. totally burned Check it. Check this yeah. out. Yeah, yeah. Look. Oh, nothing. nothing. Look at that. Spotless. And when you finish using it, guess what? You just pick it up and throw the whole thing in the dishwasher. Isn't that, br that, isn't that not brilliant? If you don't want a really big one, you fold it in half. And then okay. you go with a half. And then you I know. love it too because, as the customer reviews said, it takes up so little space. So if you've got a whole bunch of 
trivets and they're little and they're plastic or they're silicone or whatever. First off, they don't look as good. Right. And they're not as versatile. And then I do want to show them because, you know, let Mother Day, nature, nature do the work. Right. If you are washing your dishes and you want them to dry off, this is the trivet on the sink. So exactly. it doesn't stop. You know, you can use it here. It goes on small stings. And yeah, and then, uh, by the way, this is a ton of weight. Right. On and look, here. There's, there's eight plates, there's four smaller plates, a couple of coffee cups, some utensils. It doesn't blink. It is super, super strong. In fact, I'm going to I'm gonna put a really heavy weight on it later on to show you just how strong it is. No, I'm not sitting on it. Here's another <laughs> use. <laughs> Here's another. You know you get a little cutting board like this. We've all got them. And they slide around, right? So it's kind of dangerous to be using your knife. Well, guess what? Now you stick your board on the trivet. And look at that. Now my hands are sliding oh, around yeah. because the silicon's grabbing onto it. So you've now got this beautiful surface to be able to use um, your cutting board on and it's not going to be slipping around anywhere. So it's, See? It's, that's another really cool use. But hey, by the way, almost 500 have now been ordered. Just give you a scoop on what's happening. Free shipping today, customer pick, five flex for the birthday. Get your color now because we have two colors, the stone gray and the white, and we know before the day's done that some of these colors, if not both, will be completely sold out. It's always smart to get it early. Here it is, once again, in a sink, completely loaded up with the cookware, with ceramics, with your utensils on here, with lids. And notice, too, look how great it is because these are actually a little bit flexible. Right. So even a thicker lid will sit in there perfectly. Absolutely. Yeah, there's a little bit of flex um, built in there. So you see, it's beautiful to put away because it's so easy because you can literally do that. But in terms of bending it, it is super, <laughs> super strong. It's really, really tough steel. So one thing I love about this, imagine you're doing a crumble or a pie or something, you know, that you want to take straight to the table. Well, look at this. You take this directly to your dining table. That's you awesome. pop it down. It's not going to burn. It's not going to damage your dining room table. It's going to be just perfect. Again, same deal. Right next to it, let's bring this over That's and great. have a little look. What have we got? Look at that. A beautiful, like, pulled pork stew. And you can take that direct to the table without any worries about damaging your table. Right. I also use it as a bit of a caddy. So if I'm going to go outside and grill, happy 4th of July, by the way, everyone. I know it's coming up. Very exciting. I've got some ribeye steaks. I'll stick them into, a, uh, into my sheet tray like that. Then I'll take my trivet and I'll roll that out over the top. That's and awesome. then I'll throw my veggies on top because I can kind of use this as a bit of a vegetable caddy, right? So I can pick that up and move it around. And that's how I go out to grill with that whole thing. So I've got my steaks separated from my vegetables. And then when I cook them all, I've got different ways of bringing them back inside as well. See, see, brilliant. And I bet you'll come up with more ideas with it when you get it at home. What are you pulling out from the back? Oh yeah, of course, oh, yeah. here we so go. You want, you want some more oh, ideas? In fact, Check you, this watch out. this. An entire tray of bacon and wow. have a look. That's stinking hot. So I'm going to stop, pop it straight down onto a trivet. But have a look That's how crispy insane. and perfect that comes out. So you out. can put this in the oven? Yeah, oh, yeah, you can take it to 500 degrees. So, you know, I'm using it as a roasting rack. You know, I've roasted chicken oh, and potatoes all over it. Brilliant. So there's just so many ways that you'll be able to use it. And by the way, you guys, if you want a little sneak peek of what's coming later, <laughs> let me just show you this. The have pans. a look what's underneath. <laughs> It's the Durapan, um, or we call it the Dura Bake because it's got your baking covered. And it's a set of two, and I would totally order them now. Yeah, they're my producer just like hot. Can we do a real quick update? Yeah, well, let's show you the price. I mean, we'll show you what the deal is. And we've literally sold several hundred, and you don't even know what the price is yet, but good idea. <laughs> um, here it is, guys. Thanks, Steve. So these are $29.98. That is the special birthday price. Um, they are very limited going into this presentation. I yeah, feel they they'll be sold out before we wrap up with Chef tonight. So if you'd like to pick them up now and take advantage of the five flex, you can. Yeah, I was thinking about this for baking. This is going to be really handy if you're baking cakes oh, yeah. or I mean, cookies. Look, I put these cookies on. No oil, no grease. Watch this. <laughs> you know, when was the last time that happened where you just knew that every single thing that you were baking was coming out of the oven perfect? You know what I like even better with your spatula? You can use a metal utensil. Like right. with your bakeware, if it's non-stick, that just gets completely oh, ruined. Yeah. And you need a nervous. spatula when you're trying to get cookies off of and on the And the, the best the best part of it is the cleanup is this. <gasps> No more crusty old <laughs> bakeware. Look at that. That's it awesome. Is so cool. So here, I, I took the cookies off the off my um, baking sheet, and what I'm doing is I'm popping it on my trivet. So now there's some air circulating around it. So you're also using it as a drying rack. So the the options. When I say the options are endless. 
It's really the understatement of the century because there's just so many different ways that you can use it. If for the price of admission here, for what you're spending on these trivets, oh if gosh. you get to protect your kitchen counters, your islands, your dining room table from hot things, chipping, burning, scratching, it is worth it in spades. You know, there's just, there's no substitute for protecting the stuff that you've uh, you've already gone and bought. And Chef, if you, I, if you go to Pinterest, a lot of people are trying to be more economical at home and they don't want to run their dishwasher as much. They don't mind hand washing. Right. Especially if, you're, if you have a couple people at home, you're like, why run a big dish load if I don't have to? They're loving and they're searching for really hip, modern, dish drying racks. Oh, you're right. And I'm mean, seriously, there's a whole category in Pinterest of trying to find really cool dish drying racks. There's nothing smarter than this. There's nothing that takes up less Check space. There's still, whatever dish racks out there are usually bulky and big, and even if they collapse, they're just not good looking. This one's so brilliant. That's why you guys have made it a customer pick. That's why we've sold 1,200 in just a couple of minutes. We have a phenomenal price tonight. Five flex pays, free shipping on it. And again, right now at midnight or before before midnight, I can guarantee both colors. I will also guarantee that both colors won't be available later on today. This is what I love for vegetables. Right, now, if this sink was working, <laughs> <laughs> what I would do... Sorry, we are on a set, ladies and gents. This isn't our home. Thank you, Rochelle. Um, so what, what, what you can also do, don't forget, is this just rolls up, like I keep explaining. You throw it over your sink and you're like, OK, time to do the veggie prep. So whether you're doing beets or peppers or lemons or carrots, you name it, you can literally wash your veggies and just drop them down. Virtually nothing will fall through the cracks and if it looks like it's going to, you just sit it on Turn the sideways. side. Right, so you But Chef, for me, it's like peppers when I cut them and then I want to clean out all the seeds. Right. I end up holding up too much water inside the pepper. Yep. Then it ends up ruining up the recipe I'm working on. Right. Because well, I haven't drained it properly. Well, guess what? Now you can do that. Right. Good, good example. You get your pepper and you cut the top off, right? right. Just like that. You go ahead and you bring that out. And once you've got that out, you can just give it a little tap and all of the stuff that you don't want goes straight through to the sink right. and the stuff that you do want sits right up there. Now, if you're ready to take this somewhere else, you pick it all up and you take your <laughs> vegetables with you just like Brilliant. That. All right, we're going to say hi to Deb in Massachusetts. Hi, Deb. You're on with Chef Curtis Stone. Welcome to HSN. How are you tonight? We're really good. good. We're, We're having, having a ball. Fun. How are you? Looks like you're having a blast. I'd like to be there cooking with you. It's <laughs> yeah. high tonight, Deb. We're not messing around. We come out of the gate strong. <laughs> oh. So I understand you've got the uh, scissor set. I got the scissor set, mm -hmm. and I have to admit that I probably have everything that you've got on that set in my kitchen right now. Wow. Is that right? I tell yeah, you what. I have a Curtis Stone kitchen for sure. Mm. <laughs> wow. That's what do you awesome. love about it? Why do you have so many things? Just the quality of, of everything. And like you say, things like this trivet that you have on right now, I have a little herb garden that's on my sink because I don't have windowsills. And I actually put my herbs on it so they get sunlight during the day. Right. Isn't that's that clever. smart? That's, that's so clever. First time we've heard that. Yeah, thank that's you for very the clever. idea. Hey, Deb, I gotta ask you a question. If anybody's shopping tonight or maybe they're brand new and they're thinking, wow, I'd really love to try the line, what would you tell them? Absolutely do it. You'll never regret it. Completely it's agree. Thank you. Well said. I, I love everything that I've gotten. The, Jur the Jura pans are the best that I've, yeah. I've ever cooked with. They're I've so replaced cool. most all my pans, so it's great. It's, ju it's just great stuff. Wow. Thank you for saying yeah, that. You make you. my night. You know, it's, it makes me so happy to hear that people are out there having great experiences. And sure. it's, 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 there's nothing more exciting than cooking for the people you love and sitting around a dinner table with them, so that's really cool. Deb, thanks. Yeah. Thank happy 4th of July. Happy 4th, Happy 4th. I hope you all have a great night. <laughs> you, too. Uh, you too. Also, you too. Get, how many pounds is this? How big is this turkey, Rochelle? <laughs> <laughs> Watch now. You think the trivet would 25. 20, you think That's, the trivet would sink. Right, now you watch this. <laughs> so this is a frozen turkey. So guess what? You wanted to frost a frozen turkey? Well, here's a really nice way to do it because now that air is circulating around the turkey. Okay. If you want to splash just a little cool water on it, you can to sort of get it going. Okay. But I've, I've defrosted chicken breasts on this and done all sorts of stuff. Brilliant. Oh, Rochelle, what do you got over there? All right. Donuts. Oh, donuts. Oh, yeah, we're going to oh, glaze yeah. some donuts. On that note, let's glaze <laughs> some donuts. And then we're coming back. We have more with Chef Kurt.
Heart of Stone. In fact, let me show you this real quickly. If you get your HSN credit card right now, we have a super deal we've never done before. You're gonna get up to $40 off whatever it is you're purchasing at that moment if you're brand new and if you're approved. So, how amazing is that? You're gonna get $40 off. So have fun, check out all the details on hsn.com and apply because guess what? When you apply and buy, you save an extra $40 and who wouldn't wanna do that? All right, coming